Hey guys, what's up? It's Isaac. Um, I just received a question on my channel on if you can put video from your computer to your iPhone. Now, yes, you can, and then yes, it's pretty easy. Um, if you're using a Windows and not an iPhone or Mac, it's a lot easier. All you do is connect your device to your computer, and then you just click and drag the video. Um, Apple really doesn't have it set up like that because if you go to Finder, I have my iPhone connected right now, and it's not pulling up in the devices. So, a very easy way to do this, and this question was asked from Bananas Premium, um, and this is the question right here. A very easy way to do this is to open up your Finder. Okay, now if you have the video saved in your Finder, which a lot of people do save it there, um, I have all my videos saved right here and I have them in a specific file. And then what you do is you connect your iPhone and then automatically it opens up the um, iTunes. So then you're going to want to go to your movies and then homemade movies. Okay, so once you're there, and if you have any questions about this, just leave it in the comments and I'll make sure that you um, aren't left hanging. Um, so if your iPhone's connected, then that's good, and if you're at movies and home videos, that's all good. So once you do that, you just find the clip that you want to put in there. So let's say I'm just going to put barefooting. Okay, so just click that and drag it over. Okay, so now that I click and drag it over, this is the video right here. So now, once you've done that, now all you have to do is basically just make sure you add this to your iPhone. So what you just do is you click and drag, and then you click to your phone. So mine's the 5S right now. So I'm just going to put it in there. It's going to take a couple seconds, and this is a lot easier than the next one I'm going to show you, but I'm going to show you this way too, just in case you want to do it that way. Okay, once you've clicked and dragged the video into your iPhone, it should automatically download into your iPhone. So then you can look here, you can go click on your iPhone, which was over here, and then click to Movies, and then it'll show you all the videos you have and all the videos that are in there. And I just imported Slow Mo Fun with two question marks. Okay, now I'm going to show you my iPhone screen and show you that it's on there. Okay, Okay. now once you've done that, you're going to unplug your iPhone, and then you're going to turn on your iPhone like normal, and then you're going to go to your videos. And it won't pull up necessarily right away, it all depends on where you left it off. Now then you're going to go to homemade videos, and there's slow motion videos right here. So, that's one way to import video to your iPhone. Okay guys, so the second way is to use iMessage. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to Finder. You're going to go to your movies and the video you want to send. Okay. Then you're going to go to this right up here. The share the selected item. Okay. And then you can email it. You can message it. You can airdrop it. You can Vimeo it. You can Facebook it. We're going to use message. Okay. I'm just going to send it to myself. Okay, two. Okay, I'm going to send that. And then in a couple seconds, it should go to my iPhone, and then I'll show you guys the video. Okay, now I have my iPhone pulled up. Now, what you're going to do is obviously you sent it to yourself on messaging, so you're going to go to messages. Okay, now this is the only one I have in here, and I made it very easy for this because I cleared them all out. So now you're going to click on that. And then you're going to have your video right there. And this is the time lapse I shot a couple months ago. Of course, it's not winter right now, but it was. And just a little time lapse video that I made. Okay, now what you want to do if you want to save it to yourself, or save it on your device, sorry about that, is you're going to click the little thing on the left corner right here. And I'm going to click that. And then it gives me numerous options as it did before when I was sending it to myself in Finder. But what you want to do if you want to save it to yourself or if you want to share it with a friend or upload it to Facebook or mail, then you obviously just click these couple right here. But since you want to save it for yourself, you're just going to save, click on Save the Video. 
guys, that about wraps it up. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions about the video or how I did some certain things in the video, just leave them in the comments and I'll make sure to answer those questions. And thanks for watching, guys. Rate and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks.